this video is not sponsored by Grove. I thought it's doing a recording for me. you all I think I bought like double of everything I have this Myers um Mrs. Myers actually clean day orange clove scent and I have two of these and this is for um it's actually aromatherapeutic um it's a household product multi-surface jeez multi-surface everyday cleaner um we use it for the table we use it for the uh, to wipe down the deep freezer the, the um counters microwave um table chairs i mean a number of things also have a um a wood one a wood um polisher and i think i have two of these too And this one is Iowa Pine Scent. And it's the same thing. It's a, a multi-surface everyday cleaner. It removes dirt, uh, freshen surface, freshen um, surfaces. You could use it on almost anything. Clean the bathroom up, anything. But I do prefer to use other things so for the bathroom. And, oh, you know what I should have did? Anyway. And I have this too. This is a dish soap from um of the orange clove uh fragrance too let me smell it because i didn't mm, smells good it smells just like orange like a light orange drink i have two of those two dish soaps and two dish soaps of the um iowa pine scent too and with this it says it's made of plant derived um plant derived cleaning ingredients essential oils aloe vera extract and glycerin made without parabens and um i don't even want to try to pronounce this word phantholates uh and artificial colors so this is a good thing i think it's um you know like organic my daughter was telling me, my little girl, she was saying that it's organic um, stuff. Because some things, you know, when you get it, you don't look at everything. You mainly look at what the purpose of it is. And once it serves the purpose that you're getting it for, you sort of get it and call it a day or whatever have you. And then I brought the hand soaps too. Y'all, I told y'all I like all this kind of stuff. So I, my house would always be stocked with this stuff. And this is the um, hand soap of the Iowa pine scent. And um, it's made with olive oil and aloe vera. And it's a good, these are good soaps. Good soaps and good um, dish detergents as well. And I have the orange clove too of the dish soap, I mean of the hand soap. It's made of the same stuff, the aloe vera and uh, aloe, aloe vera and, um, and what I said, and olive oil. Yeah. Another little package. This is a room spray. I have a, a um. A bottle already for the um for the sprays but this 
this um, liquid is lemongrass and verbena. And this smells so good. So good. Lemongrass and verbena, and it's a one fluid ounce um, little bottle. Let me smell it. I already know it smells good because I had the um, I had the multi surface cleaner in this verbena. Jesus Christ! Yeah, it smells real good. And I also have lavender and bergamot. It's one fluid ounce as well. I don't know what this one smells like. Let's see. Oh, this one is really, really light. Oh, wow. Really, really light. It smells really good. It's raining over here. What's going on y'all neck of the woods? What's going on with y'all over there? This is um, lavender and sage deodorant. And it's from Schmitz. I never had this. I want to try it. Um, on the top of it, it says, smells seriously amazing. So I got to try it. Um, it has no aluminum, salts, no um, uh, propylene glycol and no artificial fragrance so this should be really really good natural deodorant um they said a natural deodorant dry and when i grew up we used to use this deodorant called Arid, and i don't know if this is anything similar to but um it was a very to me it was very natural like my mom sort of bought us like natural body wash let me sit down right here my mom bought us like she used to buy like natural deodorants and um so we grew up on natural stuff like that well i don't know how natural that is but to me um according to the stuff that we use now like uh secret and dove and um all this other stuff it don't seem like it compared to the stuff we used to use back then like even down to the soaps the uh we she didn't buy body wash i don't think i ever knew what body wash was until i got older she used to buy us the bar soap so that's what i knew about bar soap and it wasn't so many different fragrances of different brands of fragrances of that it was like ivory and dial that's what we she stuck us with so um i mean after all like i said in my other video she she raised six kids, you know, and that was a big, that was a big one. I mean, she wasn't single, she was married, but you know how that can be sometimes. Anyway, that's another whole story. If you heard my other video or watched my other video, you would know what I'm talking about. But this is what it looks like inside. Let me smell it. Y'all know it smells like, don't mind me, it smells just like lavender. I was about to say it smells like lavender. And they have a little thing, a little um, little thing in there, like you take it out and you probably wipe it under your arm or, or I, I don't know, I have to read on it and see. But when I was purchasing it, um, and I think this came free, because you know, when you order from them, I don't know if you ever ordered from uh Mrs. Myers or Grove Collaborative or any of the um, brands under Grove, um, they always give you a little something free. Like last time I ordered, they gave me a little um, lip uh, chap, lip, uh, lip, balm. lip balm when your lips chapped. Um, and I think the fragrance was mint, mint and something. But when you put it on, your lips exfoliate and you feel like it's just working because sometimes your lips may peel or chaff or something like that and when you put it on it just 
be good and you feel secure knowing that you don't have to worry about you know your lips like right now i feel like my lips are dry so anyway um yeah this smells so good i really wish y'all could smell it you see the little thing inside like a little knife or something i want to pull it up let's see oh Oh. It's like this. I guess it's something you could take in when you scoop it up you rub it under your arms and I guess you could work it out more with your hand with your fingers but that's what it looks like it's rough time in there it's cool it's cool it's cool and it smells so good y'all because you know you don't have to you have stuff like this, you don't have to um you don't have to have on so so much like uh, sometimes people have a bunch of deodorant on under their arms and they load themselves up on um on perfume. So you really don't know what you're smelling. You're just smelling up stuff. You just smell it. Walking around smelling, smelling up stuff. You don't know. If it's the deodorant they're wearing or, or the perfume. You say, excuse me, what, um, could I ask you what kind of perfume you're using? Just name your perfume. When they tell you, you don't know what it is. You don't know whether you're smelling that or what. Anyway, um, that is pretty much it for this video. Um, if you like this video, hit the like button. And while you're at it, subscribe and um, comment down below. And when you hit the subscribe button, don't forget to hit the bell so that every time I upload, it'll let you know. Okay? So, until I see you again, I love you. Jesus loves you more. And I'm, I'm feeling a little emotional when I said that because um, I just heard word that someone... For the second time uh, this month has passed away from my church and it really hurts my heart. I mean, I don't even want to, I don't even want to cry because it hurts so much. And I feel like if I cry, what's the point? But it just hurts super bad. But anyway. Ugh, my voice is trembling and I don't want to get all all riled up. So, uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Bye.